Good evening, Internet. Craig here with Hurry Up Pinball. Tonight we are back, episode 275. We'll play a little James Bond Premium. Um, how's it going, Night Surf? I hope you're doing well. Uh, staying out of trouble? I'm trying to stay out of trouble, but we'll see. Um, yeah, so tonight, uh, I've been back on Bond in a while. Uh, so uh, one of the cool things I did, and I actually shot some video, so this will be going up soon. Um, I did a tutorial on, I put an MRS switch in Bond. I got tired of missing that loop multiplier in the back of the play field by the pop bumpers. Um, so if you have this game and you hit that shot, uh, what's up, Chewy? Um, Howdy ho! Hi, <laughs> kids, I'm Mr. Hanky. Um, uh, what's up, Chewy? How you doing? Yeah, it's a Bond night, man. Um, yeah, I put the new MRS switch in this because uh, every time you hit that loop, with the multipliers in it. Like sometimes it registers, sometimes it doesn't, so I just got tired of doing it. And I actually put two MRS switches in the orbits on Venom too, because they can uh, get a little wonky sometimes. So tonight will be the first time that I really put this through the paces. I tested it out and everything was working. I played a few games, but tonight we'll get a bunch of games on Bond and uh, we'll see how that uh, MRS switch works. Um, if you're not familiar with it, it's the magnetic read switch. Uh, M&M Creations uh, makes them. And they are, uh, I think you can get them on pin side. You just got to reach out and typically they'll tell you, ask you what game. And, um, but yeah, it's, it's, it's been working great in the couple games I've played. So uh, I'm going to kick it over to gameplay and we'll get started here. Yeah, on the upper loop. Uh, Jay McTeer, yes, uh, that upper loop uh, shot right just to the right, the switch just to the right of the rollovers for the pop bumper section. So um Anyways, uh, I will kick it over to gameplay and we'll get going here. I'll show you exactly what I'm talking about too. All right, I'm getting little magic hands. Check the cameras. All right, uh, here we go. So right back there, um, that switch down in there. Um, if you're not familiar with them, uh, basically you take the switch out, um, you splice in, it's just two wires. Um, you have one too, the ball goes airborne there sometimes. Yeah, it does, uh, but so far, even with that magnetic switch in there, it still will register. It's enough to pull it from uh, from the ball. Uh, but yeah, the switches in there were always problematic. Venom, uh, I had some issues too with it riding the wall on the right orbit if you pick it clean. So um, yeah, it's helping, but tonight we'll check it out and we'll see You know, if if it uh, if we miss any of them. I don't think we will, but hope, hope it works. Um, all right, uh, yeah, as always, any issues with the sound? Oh, let me check the audio levels. That's the one thing I didn't do. I didn't check before I started. All right, let me know if that's good. Uh, we'll go eight. Eight's usually pretty good. Um, yeah, but I shot a video for it and I will, uh, I'll get that up soon. I gotta edit it and do the voiceover for it, but I shot all the footage. Uh, really simple install. Uh, I think the switches are about 30 bucks a piece, 32, 33, 35 tops. Maybe it was 35, um, but they were great. I have four of them in Rick and Morty, and it solved the problem with those switches there too, because they're they're really wonky in in um, in uh, Rick and Morty. So uh, we'll see. Uh, we'll get going tonight. Hopefully, it can get through the villains again. Um, I haven't gone through all the henchmen modes. I've only gone through the villains mode. So uh, again, it's off of that shot right there, which is a tough one. So. Always a little hard, but all right. I am going to log in. It's been a while since I've played this game, so we'll we'll see how bad I get beat up tonight. Um, never heard of it before, night sir. Yeah, so uh, they just slide into the slot where you would normally have the switch, and it doesn't stick up above it. It's just slightly recessed, just a tiny little bit in there. And there's um, there's a piece of metal uh, in it, and as the ball just rolls over it, it gets really close to it and rolls over it. It registers a switch hit. So it actually doesn't touch the pinball at all. Uh, doesn't slow it down. Um, so if you have switches that you're hitting the switch and it's kind of like bouncing around on the switch, it's a, a good choice. One of the other really cool things um, is I think they make some custom ones for some of the games where you have a switch. Like, I could be wrong, but I think they had one for Diner, for the cup in the back of Diner, because it's like mounted sideways and sometimes the ball's not spinning fast enough, it won't register. <clears throat> but I think they make one for that. It could be could be mistaken but uh they work really well if you're having problems with switches so all right here we go it's yapping too long all right let's see how bad i get beat up tonight it's been a while since i played this and i have a feeling it's not gonna be friendly all right here 
here we go. <laughs> Starting it off the right way, aren't we? I forgot how fast this game was. Let me know if the game volume needs to come down a little bit. Come on. I am off on that orbit shot. That left orbit? Not happening right now. There we go. Oh, I didn't want to get into it that fast. I want to start a mode first. Ah, uh, I was like, oh, we can go after the multiplier. I got in the way. That one's gone. Ah. Uh, there it is, got it. too much venom. Ugh. That's a martini shot. Oh my god. Really? And there go my multipliers. What have three of them damn things flashing? <laughs> What's up, Jordan? Nope, the game audio is good for me, so it doesn't need any adjustment. Alright, cool. Thanks, Jordan. Um, now I just have to play better. Wow, did you see that ball spin backwards? All right, now we're still on ball one, so I'll take it. My dear uncooperative Domino. How do you know that? How do you know my friends call me Domino? It's on the bracelet on your ankle. Oh, so, genius. I wish you could skip some of these uh, scenes. They do take a while sometimes. All right, gold finger. Anybody up for Goldfinger? There's my multiplier. You have been recognized. This is by one of your officer numbers, who is also nice to you. It's nice to be able to hit that shot at speed and have it register. Alright. Oh, through solid metal, I will show you. You calm down. This is the oldest one. Ah, I was trying to sneak in another multiplier. Yeah, it seems to be working pretty good so far. Oh, come on. I feel like the game's a little unlevel. I moved. I had to move a couple of the games over because I couldn't. I have one game at the end where I always put my streaming rig when I'm not um, when I'm not playing, when I'm not streaming. I kind of put it over there, and uh, it was so tight I had to move all the games over like six inches. So I don't know if uh, the floor's a little bit wonky there or not. But. All right, let's see if we can. <laughs> Welcome to James Bond, ladies and gentlemen. Damn. Thanks. Not mess around. Only 35 more loops to light extra ball. That's manageable. Front right, uh, front left, a tiny little bit. I think it's rolling a little bit that way. We'll see how this works. Please stop shaking the gate. Really? Relax. 
relax, man. Child's play. <laughs> this thing's beating the crap out of me. I feel like a child. There's your multiplier. Ah, uh, I sneak that one in there. I am very ready for 1.0. Yeah. How you doing, pinboils? Hope every uh. I always say pinboil. Oh, extra balls lit. All right, we'll take it. There's one of my complaints with this game. That switch up there is is wonky. Extra um, kind of hit. It kind of hits weird. I hope I never have boils. <laughs> yeah, in balls. Oh. No, you. Oh, I had ball save too. Dude. I'm starting to think somebody snuck into my house and adjusted this tilt bob. Either that or I've just been playing uh, Venom way the hell too much. Uh, that could be it. I've. I've. Oh. Ugh. Check and I didn't change it. I just think it's... Yeah, I think nudging a certain way on this is problematic. Ah, oh, didn't go. Damn, dude. <laughs> I think I've just been beating the crap out of Venom for so long I'm not used to what a normal kill feels like now. There we go. Let's see if we can get DB5 multiball. I should have the laser mod by next week, so at least I have that to look forward to. Yeah. Yeah, I'm ready for the for the coat to be done on this. I'm curious. What else, if anything, they're going to add to it? So pinballs is the. Uh, do you know is the uh, is the wizard mode in this already? The Her Majesty's Secret Service. Did they put that in already? Hang on a sec. I'm going to make one more adjustment. Alright. It's not a hurry up stream unless I mess with something. Alright. I uh I raised that side, but the back was still kinda of, still wobbly, so. Alright, game number two. Um It's better not just uh better not just be the, the wizard mode. Yeah. Yeah, I've uh let's see. Turgid boo boo. That's a great name. On YouTube it says, I've owned this game for about eight months now. Great game, but I find I either love it or absolutely hate it in certain days. Yeah, some days this game can be super duper mean. And other days you put everything together and it feels great. But I'll tell you, when you have a great game on this, it feels good. Uh, needs to be a better way to complete the films. Venom, Henchman, Spectre, Weapons. Yeah, it's... Yeah, I, I, could, I could see some variation, but it's just got so much content in it. To me, it's got so much content, it kind of... That helps a lot. Um, damn it. Oh, come on. There we go. Give me that one. <laughs> I'm hoping they incorporate the movie inserts as uh, the way to start the wizard modes instead of the six billion or henchman crap. Yeah, it'd be. I like it when games allow you to get into things like via different routes. Like you kind of pick your adventure, so to speak. If that makes sense. All right, this one is just drop targets. Blast away at the drop targets until they're done. You got to be quick on these drops, though. There we go. Multiplier? No. 
Unless you can Ah! Damn it! I gave number 11 the strictest orders to eliminate him. I got double for that. And did she? That was totally she not double failed. worthy. Oh. This is gonna be a long night on Bond, I have a feeling. Just when I thought I was I was feeling good, you know, my my uh, pinball skills are getting better. Then I play Bond and it reminds me that I should never get too excited. There it is. There's your multiplier shot. Honey Rider. Oh, I will. That's why it's tough on Blofeld. Uh, many straight down. Yeah, straight down the middle opportunities, man. If you don't pick it right. I really like how they added rewards for completing the Spectre modes. It still feels like most Q modes are an inconvenience. Yeah, I, I do like that when you beat certain Q modes, there's multi-ball stuff that comes up. I do like that, because it's a reward for doing well in it. Uh, Turgis says, I feel like my wife has more bad games than good ones on this one. Might not be long for uh, the game room. Yeah, it's, it's a tough game. I, I like it, though, because it was... They just added so much to it. Everybody was pretty upset initially, and they added a ton to it. And I feel like it's where it needs to be now, but a lot of people have kind of moved on. Um, but, yeah, it's, it's a great game. Oh, come on. Super Spinner is lit. There it is. One more. Still can't believe it's not 1.0, Taylor. Yeah, I hear you. Yeah, the multi balls are fun, but progression wise, it feels like a roadblock. Yeah. I'll tell you, I'm running into stuff on Venom where it's stacking things in a certain order. And uh, it's getting in the way of me starting what I really want to start. And then it's like, great, I'm forced to complete this before I can get to the thing that I really want to play right now. All right, cool. We're into the DB5 multi ball. This is a good start. Let's see if we can pluck off that orbit over there. Let's hit the multiplier. Oh, there we go. Extra ball and double jackpot. Ooh, that was a nice jackpot. Oh, let's get another multiplier. Oh, I didn't make it. Dude. I just got it. All right, here we go. Ah! Oh, I know. Time is all forever. Uh, Godfather forces you to avoid uh, shots just like that. Yeah, there's uh, Venom has those shot or Jaws has it. Um, we're during scars. If you hit the towers, it actually decreases the jackpots. Oh. Shit. Shaking the day. Oh well, at least you got an extra ball. Hi, Craig and Chat Gargoyles. <laughs> What's up, Bondo? How you doing, buddy? Um, yeah, sorry, I had I had a lot going on. Um, I was up hanging out with Matt and Matt, my buddy Matt in Asheville yesterday. I uh, had kids' games and stuff on Saturday and. Uh, shot video uh, for anybody who's just joining now. I did actually put the MRS switch in this, the magnetic read switch. Uh, it's from Eminem Creations. I shot a video for it, so I just got to edit it. That'll be going up on my channel soon. So if you're interested to see how the install goes, it's pretty easy. Um, I did it where I sealed up the um, the two wires. Uh, I put a heat shrink on them and everything, and I I soldered the two wires together. Um, you know, I'm sure there's other ways you can do it, but that's the way I like to do it when I put those switches in. It's pretty easy. Um, you know, if you have a soldering iron too, it's, they're, they're pretty, it's pretty easy to put in. So. Um, and boy, I said recently, uh, I've just been, uh, prepping my multi-balls and waiting until I have 7X ready. Then I use the multi-balls to get my 7X collect. That's a smart way to do it, but I usually screw it up really bad before I get to 7X. And then I'm usually really angry I didn't use it sooner. Um, oh shit, here we go. 
Snuck that one in. Soldered heat streak, good stuff. Yeah, that's. I just like to do it that way. To to me, that's that's the best way. That's the the best way you can do it. Because it's nice and clean, and you don't have to worry about it coming loose. Um, sweet. I'm so used to Venom only giving you one extra ball. Like it's really hard to get two extra balls in Venom. Um, so I'm like, man, I already got two. One game. I'm telling you, man, that thing's break. That thing's trying to break my spirit. I like it, but it's trying to piss me off consistently. Oh, I got away with that one. Oh, perfect. Ah, I keep trying to get a multiplier going. Or collect it. Can't do it. All right, up the middle. I still have issues trying to figure out this the whole the whole stacking situation. Oh, that's a new an is that a new animation? I've never seen that one before. Oh, come on. The whole stacking thing with the button kind of screws me up because I usually end up blowing through my missiles and all I want to do is get to my multiplier. Uh So, pinballs, pinballs, I used to call you pinballs, I keep thinking boils now. Um, is there a way that when you have missiles, you can actually get to the multiplier? I tried to like long press, but it didn't seem to work. Oh my god. Get in. God, I can't get the ball to go in the stupid... It always goes in accidentally when you don't need it. Oh, God. I was... Don't give me three. <laughs> Let's see. Did the bond loop plastic not resolve the switch not registering? Um, I didn't buy the bond loop plastic. I knew the MRS switch would would resolve it, so I just went I went that route. It was like I think 30, 35 bucks. Um, Sadists naturally gravitate to pinball design. <laughs> yeah. uh, use the uh, use the flippers. Oh, if you use the flippers, will it change the colors? The flippers alternate between smart missile. See, I didn't know that. Um, you still have to take a quick look to see what color the action button is. Yeah, because when it's pink, that's the multiplier. When it's blue, it's the missile, I think. So, learn something new every day. I never understood that. I was always in a hurry, and I'm like, oh. I'm like, screw it. We'll just blow through the missiles so we can get the multiplier. And then I'll be closer to beating whatever mode it was. All right. All right, this is the mode where I got to make sure I don't... I'm gonna make sure I don't tilt, because there's no reason to. It's a very hard thing for me to do. shot when I want it. Oh, come on. Oh, I should just let it drain. I'm an idiot. Let him drain. Come on. There it is. Sweet. Is that time's up? 
Did I beat it? I don't know. The Bond Girl loop builds the jackpot higher. Uh, gotcha, and spots a shot. Okay. Oh, uh, forever? This is not a bad game. I can't complain. We're only on ball two, and I got an extra ball right now. I was ready to give up on this game when we started. Oh, I forgot there's no... Uh... Yes, you beat it. Yeah, I thought so. I, I guess I hit that multiplier shot and it spotted stuff. Wow, 60 million for that. I'll take it. Yes, you did beat Bond, James Bond multiple, nice job. Yeah, it's, I'm usually so busy, like, I didn't hear it time out where it's like time's up. So I'm like, oh shit, it's over. I must have beat it. This is one of those games that, you know, I'm, I'm, I do hesitate unless I absolutely need to, to look at, um, I do hesitate to look up too often and look at the screen. Man, that would have been nice to start that mode and then start jetpack. That was a good bonus. Was that uh, 17 million times three or was it 17 million total? No dice. The henchman ramp is the final shot. Oh, gotcha. Yeah, I was like, dude, why am I playing these? Just let them drain and I can just keep getting shots on it until I make it, hopefully. Is that it? Be the one. Aha! That is the first time I've done that. That was pretty cool. Start me a multi-ball. Oh! That thing was not messing around, man. Come on. God. <laughs> Come on, buddy. Let's go. Let's make something happen. There we go. That's what I wanted. All right. Oh, power pack. This is when you really want the multiplier. Oh, no. I'm this happy. What a wonderful surprise. Which I have. I'm going to go ahead and use my multiplier. All right. No, sorry. Shit. It's already running. That's right. Sorry. Build it up. Come on. 11 seconds. All right, here we go. break a bill. Anytime I break a bill on this game, I'm pretty happy. Get in there. Alright, 3.5. Q's ring. Ah, there's a lot of side to side in this game, man. It is dangerous. Oh. Ah, 
on, come on. Oh, I was trying to hit that one into the... Uh... go. Snuck that one in. What was a 45 million dollar, 45 million jackpot? I'll take that all day long, man. That was a pretty good one. No, 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 no. Don't you do it. No, 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 no. Good lord. Um... Hang on. Uh, Chase Rat said, what a coincidence. Bond and Jaws have a character named Jaws and... What is that? And Robert Shaw. Yep. Um, that's Chase Rat on YouTube says, oh wait, Jaws isn't this game, but still Robert Shaw. Yeah, Jaws in the background right over here. nervous right now. Multiplier. Nope. Ah, it's a tough shot, man. Woo-wee! Oh, oh! Oh, come on, dude. This thing's torture me right now. Get I'm like, dude, I'm gonna. I feel like I'm about to lose it. I knew it! I knew it! Give me the missiles! Oh, that was a good game. That was a good one. Uh, games in that on YouTube says, yeah, great table, man. Yeah, it's fun. It's that. Uh, pin, uh, pinballs, uh, throw your initials in chat. Did you see? Enter your initials. Ah, high score number two. Uh, throw them in chat. You were seven pops away from an extra ball. Of course I was. MTL. There you go. I knew it was M. Um, all right, we'll get you in here. Not a bad way. That was the second game of the night. So we'll get a couple more going. See if we can uh, best that. Oh, I got to make an adjustment on this action button at some point. Got to hit it hard. There we go. Um, you completed Bond, James Bond Multiball by getting the super jackpots via the side ramp after qualifying it by getting enough jackpot shots within the 70 seconds allowed. Also a great game. I appreciate it, Jordan. That was, a, that was a good one. That one escalated pretty quickly. I mean, that first ball was trash, and then it just it got a lot better after that. Easiest high score ever. Uh, seriously. Oh, man. <clears throat> All right, well, well, we'll get a couple more going on this. I mean, we're 34 minutes in. I mean... It's way too early to be like, all right, that's probably the best it's gonna get tonight. Um, uh, that's Martini. I do like the fact that it gives you an award for when that does happen. Because that's a dangerous thing when it comes down that ramp. It makes me nervous. So the question is, could I get through all the henchmen? I still just can't, I can't get the timing of that uh, multiplier loop shot. I've always struggled with that shot, man. Oh, by the way, has anybody started watching uh, the Fallout series on Amazon based on the video games? Uh, it just came out. Uh, and uh, I've watched the first two episodes, and it's it's pretty interesting. I'm, I'm enjoying it so far. I don't know if anybody else has uh, checked that out yet. But it seems like it's got a pretty good storyline going on it. So. Get 
getting that multiplier loop. Come on. Close the shutters. There we go. All right, what do we got? Oh man, um, you have to spend some time going for 7x, 7x Bond, James Bond. Oh, I bet, I bet that is insane. You can use your uh, your smart missiles to spot the one bird uh, multi ball extension. Are you talking about right now? All right, let's do it. Oh, that was my henchman award. Perfect. <laughs> that worked. Got through that. Ah. Back out. Oh, I got two. Don't give me three. Thank you, Tilt Debounce. Ah, <laughs> oh, come on. I'm trying, dude. Can't put pressure on me like that. Go. Thank you. Uh, I'm not gonna make it. Give me the ball. Get in there. There we go. Damn it. I didn't want to do that, but I knew I'd, I'd get through that mode if I hit it. Let's see if we knock out this extra ball. There we go. I like it when you hit it, it stops. Alright, let's see if we can get the. Uh, Bonus health, so don't tilt out, right? Jetpack's ready. Yeah. Uh. There it is, sweet. 48 million for that, I'll take it with the multiplier. Long enough, didn't it? It does stack animation sometimes for a very long time. <laughs> I really should go through and read the detailed uh, instructions on uh, from Stern on this. I. I I know enough to be dangerous on this game, but there's still a few things I'm a little fuzzy on. Ah, let's go. Screw it. Let's make something happen. Ah, side ramp. Ah, get out of the way, dude. Why you got to both? I didn't invite both of you. Shots, man. Oh, come on, dude. And there's a shot I needed that I couldn't get. Damn. This thing. I had the super ready before the multi ball technically started before. Um, yeah, it, it stacks. It can stack some, it can do some weird stacking stuff in this game. Or I think some of the animations just take so long that... I've had times where I'm like, oh, I drained my ball, and then like, 10 seconds later, they're like, multi-ball! 
I'm not complaining because it saved my ass, but. All I'm trying to do right now is uh, hit that shot. That's all I wanted, man. Screw it. I'm all about using the multipliers at inappropriate times right now. Pinball is probably like, what are you doing? I'm feeling overly optimistic right now, which is a bad thing. This house we don't get out of uh, bed until 7x. There you go. I'm hating it. <laughs> I know you probably are. Oh. Ball save. Don't waste it. <laughs> I know it's killing you. Keep going, keep going. Get more, get more, get more, get more. Come on. Of course. You'll want to complete the Spectre targets to build bird one jackets. Oh, I do. Is that what I should be doing? Come on. 7X is 7X is pretty awesome. It's like. I don't know if I've ever gotten 7x queued up before. That's how I feel about that. Oh, man. I didn't tilt out, which is good. Not a bad bonus. Alright, Bond, James Bond's ready. get through this. Extra ball is going to be lit soon, I think. Oh, is that a multiplier? I got some. Ah, oh, that drop target's rapid firing on me. Doing. Oh boy, I hope that doesn't kick out an error. Come on, why you gotta be like that? I should let it drain. Drop target just keeps cycling like crazy. Is he gonna keep doing it or did it stop? There we go. Yeah, that was weird. It just kept bang, 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 just firing off. So usually when it keeps firing like that over and over and over, you usually wanna. I wanted to see if it was resolved. Maybe it was something going on in the mode that was weird, but um, there's the shot I need, right? Um, but it looks like it's stopped. 
But you do want to be careful with stuff like that because if it fires too much like that, it'll actually reset the game. Um, older games, that can actually burn up the coils. So I think the game was trying to communicate Morse code to hit the entry. Yeah, no shit. <laughs> but I didn't listen. It was Morse code. That would be pretty funny if they did that. Like, hey, hey, dumbass, hit the ramp. Dude, we got another one ready? All right. Two extra balls. Lined up, I'll take it, man. I will show you. Extra ball. All right, jetpack. Don't hate me, pinballs. I saw the button. I got excited. Ah. Oh. might be a, an ex, a perfect example of, of how to waste your multiplier. Check that thing when I'm done. You would have had 7x at least five times this game if you would have stopped prematurely touching the button. You know what? I can't help it. You know, I get excited and I just gotta mash away at it, right? What is that thing doing? Probably a switch issue. I know. Oh. Death, death by Darby. You know what I, I think the problem is? I gotta be honest with you on this. I think the problem is, in the normal games, I was missing that multiplier shot so much. I think with that switch fixed, I'm getting it a lot more, and I'm just, I'm not used to that. I'm used to only getting it a small handful of times. Like, the idea of getting to 7x when that switch isn't working was brutal. Um, there we go. Go! Money penny, break the habit. I know, seriously, I should. I should tell you, man, when I when I get greedy, things get uh okay, I'm not gonna turn Oh shit. Shaking the gate. See, I was lit up. That's why I'm always like, dude, I gotta I gotta hit it. I'm gonna lose it. Uh, also you can light all the multipliers and not collect it. Yeah. Um, when you drain the ball, they all go away, though, don't they? I gotta check that out when we're, when we're done here. Uh, that's driving me nuts. I don't like it when it randomly fires like that. There we go. Q branch. And not a bad game. Not if they are all flashy. Not if they are flashy. Gotcha. Radioactive reconnaissance. All right, let's see what we can do here. Got it first try? Nice. Spinner's still flicking like low fell. Yeah, it doesn't want to stay up. It's probably a little adjustment on it.
not even gonna get close. Mr. Henderson, once they are all lit, uh, solid, you lose them. Ah, gotcha. Yeah, see, I need to read up on that. I still only bought one, I'll take it. We had a similar issue with the drop on Paragon. I had to reposition washer so it would catch better when you're sitting. That's the first time this has ever done that. I just think, I don't know, I just think it, I can probably make a tiny little adjustment to something and it'll probably hold it. Oh, come on. A rob me like that? I got robbed. I'd love to. And we will. Attache. Brief? Oh, briefcase. I'm super rusty at that shot, backhanding it. There we go. I struggle a lot with that shot, man. That is not an easy shot for me to get down. Backhand. Yeah, I'm horrible at this mode, yeah. Use all the smart missiles. All right. There we go. Triple jackpot, 100 by helicopter. And a multiplier. That was the easiest. That was the easiest mode I've ever played on this game. It's not tough. <laughs> Did he say a jackass cartridge? All right, let's make it happen. Screw the pooch on that one. All right, into another mode. All right, DB5. Oh. oh. Go, 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 go. Son of a bitch. There we go. Get in. Alright. What do we got? Tons of points. Give me a billion points. Whole bonus. Alright, so don't tilt out. Oh, power pack. I would love to get through power pack. Uh, I don't like it when it plays these games with me. Be like you're gonna be like that you are gonna be like that aren't you you suck thank you make me waste tilt over here i don't lose my bonus either so i gotta be careful
game toys with you at the same time. It's, yeah, it's toying with me right now, man. Seven seconds left, man. No missiles. Give me the ball. Come on. Make the shot. Of course not. No oh, shit. Well, it's over. My dear uncooperative dog. Oh, here we go. Come on. It's on your bracelet. It's on the bracelet on your ankle. Uh, so, such a detective. Sharp little eyes. Is he looking at her ankle? Alright. Oh, you son of a bitch! Screwed the pooch on that one. Here we are. Beautiful ball three. Complete Goldfinger. How did that work? That was weird, but that switch on the side loop shouldn't trigger when the ball is hitting the pop bumpers. That switch should only trigger... Hang on. Oh shit. Yes! George says, but that switch on the side loop shouldn't trigger when the ball is hitting the pop bumpers. That switch should only trigger when you actually shoot the inner loop from the upper flipper. Yeah, it, should, it shouldn't be triggering, because um, that ball's nowhere near it. There's, there's not enough distance in there, I, I don't think, to trigger that. I think almost jumped over the switch in the outlay. Dude, the spin on that ball is insane. Oh. Shit. I don't know how many that is. Probably too many. Yeah, that spin's insane. Oh, come on. What are you talking about? We got plenty of time. We got plenty of time to mess this game up. Middle, come on. Damn it. Largo, we all we need is Rosa Clip. Um, oh, I lit an insert celebration. Gotcha. Oh, yeah. Never get through this one. I'm gonna make a liar out of myself on stream right here. Multiplier's lit. Oh! Oh! Nasty. That was that was pretty nasty. In a good way. Oh, don't want to use my missile. Yeah, screw it. Why not? 
We shall go for it. All right. Jetpack is ready. All right, let's pop off jetpack. We got 46 minutes or seconds left in this mode. Come on. There it is. Is that it? Sorry, I'm gonna go ahead and use it. Oh. Oh, it was in there. Come on. Got it. Sweet. I'll take it. Alright, super jackpot's ready. Multiplier's running 5x. Come on. Give him ball! Give him ball, give him ball, give him ball. Give him ball. You're icing me out, dude. There it is. 50 million for that one. I will take it. Oh, double in the scoop. We got two balls. Oh my god, that was brutal. Ball safe still running, so I'm good. Oh. Damn, dude. Come on. Give me all the points, dude. I want them all. I can't hit that shot right now. You're distracted, man. Oh, get out of the way, dude. There it is. 20 mil. comments in a second. Please stop shaking the game. So yeah, Craig, I just picked up my Elvira House of Horrors today. Anything I should keep an eye on? I remember you had some tutorial videos on the YouTube. Um, that's basement collectibles. Yeah, the, the left ball guide, um, I did a video on uh, how you can kind of move that ball guide out a little bit so it doesn't feed directly in a slingshot. The other one everybody's been having a problem with is um, check the little subway behind the backboard and make sure that the opto is lined up because um, if you're playing it and it's firing, you hear that solenoid firing or the, um, not the solenoid, the, uh, why can't I think? My brain's not working today. The coil firing behind the backboard and it repeatedly does that, it'll shut the game down. So keep an eye on that. And keep an eye also on the cables um, behind the house. There's a little air. If the ball keeps getting stuck when you hit the orbit, um, uh, you know, take a look because sometimes it's that cable. Uh, now look at your score and imagine what if I waited two more X. I know, dude. Seriously. Yeah, I'm with you, man. I probably could have done a little better. <laughs> All right, here we go. Oh yeah. Three in a row. I'll take it. I will take it all day long. This grass one of the best spin we've ever had. Extra ball is lit. Dude. Um You're doing great. Let's see the wizard mode now. Yeah, I need to I need to get the uh, villain wizard mode. Hopefully. There we go. That's what I needed. I wish I had some missiles, but I don't. Um, I 
Ah, uh, yeah, the side loops. See, so Jordan says, that's why you're lighting the playfield multipliers and progressing towards the extra ball much faster than normal with the pop bumpers. And normally, that can only be done with the side loop. Yeah, I'm hitting that loop now, and it's registering, which is nice. You can actually control the wizard may Good safe try. Yeah, I, I tried. Test Bishop. I, I, I tried, man. Um, Tell you, man, that probably would have been a nice multiplier. Did you mod the loop? Uh, hang on. Duel on the Disco Volante. I haven't played this one yet. Right now, it's on Doctor No. Yeah, I need to. I need to pick your brain on uh, what to do there. Um, I'm assuming it's it's here. How do you change? which one of those you end up playing. Or the wizard mode. Is, is the wizard mode also tied to those? That would have been a nice bonus had I not screwed that up, man. It's the insert that is flashing the quickest. Gotcha. Okay. Oh, I got robbed on that one. Got it. Damn it. See, I'm all saving my multiplier right now. <laughs> I knew that was gone, man. Nothing I can do about that one. Oh, oh, oh nasty. That was nasty. Um, let's see, Pinball says the villain insert that is flashing the fastest is the wizard mode you will play. I think you can change it with the gold finger target or pops. Okay, not entirely sure. I just play whatever pops up. Yeah, I have two. I played the Crab K one. Uh, Alright. My god, it's so much nicer to have this game where I can actually get credit for hitting that uh, loop and not get robbed. There we go. Give it to me. Give me a missile. Sweet. Um, yeah, it's nice to be able to hit that shot because apparently I've been hitting it a lot and not getting jack crap because it's been skipping the uh, orbit. Um, Tess Bishop, you asked if I modded the game. I actually, I didn't mod the game. I replaced the, um, I didn't change anything on the play field other than the uh, switch. The MR, I put a magnetic read switch in right there to take out the physical switch because that one would always get, when you hit it, pick it clean. Sometimes it'll ride the wall and go up and over and not trigger the switch. So I just put the switch in. So now it's actually working like it's supposed to. Um. Oh. Shouldn't have done that. Bad idea. There we go. Seen it too firsthand. Yeah, it, it's it's really good. I, I put I just put it in like two days ago. I'm gonna actually make a video and put it on my YouTube channel. Um, 
so I already shot the footage, so I just need to uh, edit it and do the voiceover. And that way everybody can see kind of what you got to do if you want to put one of those in. They work great. I have them in Rick and Morty. I put two of them in uh, Venom because I was having issues with uh, one of them registering. Similar problem is kind of riding the wall. Um, and I put them in. It seems to be working a lot better now. Pretty rusty at hitting that shot up there. Don't don't double me, don't double me, don't double me, don't double me, please. Sorry, I'm gonna use it. Get in there. I don't have any tilts left, so. I'm pretty sure this is a GC game for me. Test Bishop, throw your initials in chat and we'll get you in here, all right? Thank you. Trying to give me a heart attack, man. I'm not wasting my, my boss. Um, oh, that's cool. AFG. All right, you got it. All up good. <laughs> nice. It's basically a proximity sensor. I use those all the time in uh, automation tools I build at work. Yeah, Night Surf, it's awesome. Hey, there you go, AFG. Grand champion. Um, bang. Yeah, that was a good game, man. What's up, uh, what's up, Nathan? How you doing, buddy? Um, I just had a killer game. It was the best game I've ever played on this. Uh, so I've had two really good games tonight. High score number uh, two um, and, uh, and this one, which was GC. Uh, finally broke two bill on this. Um, the question is, I do have a drop target that's kind of getting a little wonky on me. See? All right, all right, um, all right. Oh, uh, thank you. Bondo, oh, Bondo Blast, thank you for the bits. Sorry, I was like, I'm all over the place. Um, I think I'll go one more. That pop, that pop, uh, that stand-up target is being a little uh, funny. See? Um, I need to, uh, I'm need to dig into that. But I'll play one more. Um, what's up, Fight Cave? How you doing? Uh, so Nathan and Fight Cave are on YouTube. So if you hear me speaking, reading out stuff you don't see on the screen on uh, Twitch, uh, they're on YouTube, so... I've been trying to read those out so everybody can hear it. Uh, see it. Hear it. Hear it. Not see it. <laughs> All right. This will be the last game of the night. Except I, I'm going to presume that that... Um, or these might all be invalidated because that drop target's being weird. But it's not giving me points. <laughs> um, see, that's an awesome score. I'm only at one point... Yeah, I was at like 1.6, I think, or 1.7 before I started streaming tonight. I, and again, it's the multipliers. Now that I have that switch working... And I can take advantage of those multipliers. It's helping a lot. It's helping getting extra balls, too. So if you have this game and you have issues with that, check out that multi-read switch. Or magnetic read switch, not multi-read. You know what I'm talking about. <laughs> All right, here we go. Oh, I love that shot. That's my favorite shot in this game. Bunch of shots. 
Yeah, the bond loop plastic is an alternative solution. I've just never. Yeah, part of it too was uh, with Venom. I was having issues with it on there too, so I just figured, hey, I'm gonna order order two for that. I'll just order another one for Bond. Uh, those sensors are super reliable. I could definitely see them being used on games instead of physical switches and opto switches in the future of pinball. I agree with you, man. I wish they would just do that, just bite the bullet and use them, because it's it's less parts to to go bad, and some people don't know how to fix their games either. Like, it's one less obstacle for people who own games. Like, some people are nervous to work on them, and they don't like, I don't want a whole bunch of games because stuff's gonna break and I don't know how to fix it. Like, you should always kind of learn the basics of how to fix stuff, but that'd be great. I mean, um, to just throw those switches in everywhere. I think Alien had a lot of proximity switches in it, which were really cool. Um, see, my switch is fine. It's that I can't hit the bloody shot consistently. I'm with you, Nathan, me too. Um, tonight, I've been hitting a decent amount, but normally not the case yeah i wonder why they aren't adopted more i think it's just the cost um i noticed on stern games they used to the base plates used to be more substantial now they're like really thin plastic the the mounting for the the switches you know looks a little cheaper than it used to um but yeah totally cost thing um but man you know if you did it with all of these one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven uh 12 13 there'd be 13 in this game you know so even if they were think about this even if they were like even if they bought them in bulk and they were five bucks a piece i mean 65 bucks right there on switches and i'm sure they can get the other ones hella cheap uh, but i would love that would be something nice I, I wish they would start doing that um it would eliminate I think it eliminate it would it would eliminate service calls too. I think at least help to eliminate some of them. Yeah, the opto switches have been pretty decent lately, but uh, I've had a couple games where they've gone out. There's more the like Spike One games. The Spike One games didn't have very good optos in them. This is, yeah, uh, yeah, Spike One like Walking Dead. The one on the prison always went out. And it was like speaker cable wire for the optos. It's kind of weird. Wow. Damn, dude. <laughs> See? I broke the rule. I actually had two good games tonight. And I just put a GC game on and played another one. But... All right. Ball three magic. Here we go. There's my loop. DB5 Silver, what is that? DB. I don't know what DB5 Silver is. Is that just to play it a certain number of times? This game does not want me to have that shot. Play DB5 25 times. There you go. Thank you. Um, I can't be upset about that. I love ripping the spinner in this game. The, it's an opto spinner. That's what I love. It's an opto spinner, and that thing just goes. They need to put those. They need to put those in every game too. Opto spinners, they should all be opto spinners, man. I love opto spinners. I wish Jurassic Park had an opto spinner. Um, all right, cool. Told you, ball three magic, right? Ooh, scaring me, you're scaring me, man. Don't be scaring me. There it is. 
Alright. Let's see. Here's a nice little transmitting device. Order. Yeah, you can get them uh, for 10 to 20 retail. Yeah. Even at 10 bucks, man, that's a lot of money. 130 bucks to put into this game just for switches. It'll take some pinball company. I, uh, uh, pinball Brothers has actually been, uh, I think they're using them already. Because um, Alien didn't really have any physical switches on the playfield, other than stand up targets. Oh, it timed out. Damn it. Oh, wait, no, it didn't. Oh, yeah, it's over. Sorry. There we go. All right, right into power pack. What's my multiplier at? I don't even know. No, it's only lit. At, it's only at one. All right. Let's see if I can do something with that. Oh, I got away with that one. Right. If I can get into power pack multi ball. I'd be pretty, pretty happy about that. Mark. Collect them all up the middle. Oh, there we go. Multiplier. Oh. Damn, dude. There's nothing I can do about that one's gonna leave. That was leaving the play field. In. Thank you. You're gonna time out on me, man. Yeah, I got three smart missiles. I was kind of waiting to. I still need one more. Did I get it? Oh, I hit it too many times. There it is. Come on. Get me in there. Get me in there. Get me in there. All right, let's hit some shots. Alright, I'll take that one. 46 million. I'm really digging this multiplier loop uh, actually working now. I'm not gonna lie, it's making me pretty happy. It's definitely helping my scores. I've had this game for months. I should have done this a long time ago. I just dealt with it. I was like, oh, it's not that bad. Now I realize what the hell I was missing. Messing around right now. Flying through the Q branch modes, aren't we? Smart missile would have been a triple jackpot and huge. Yeah, I was all out of them, I think. Ooh. All right. I kind of want to knock this scoop shot out because that's the one that always screws me. I'll say. Um, Q mode is, is, is the trash of trash. Q's ring? Oh, yeah. I, I'm not a big fan of this Q's ring mode. It just doesn't feel very rewarding. It will come down to the pin manufacturer putting cheap proximity sensors in, and that would be the new failing point of the case. <laughs> Put in the good ones, man. These ones work great. Up the middle, up the ramp, and right there. All 
Alright, extra ball's lit. Yeah, one million jack. Oh, you son of a bitch. Can't get excited, man. You get excited in this game and it bites you in the, bites you in the ass. You have no warnings. It doesn't matter. I don't have any pinballs. <laughs> no, I know. I was... Uh, there's a couple... I have to slap at this game. I have to slap at this game. I just can't get the nudge in there. That's all I want. Perfect. And the only way for that inner loop switch to trigger is when the ball does go far enough to hit the switch. Your magnetic switch must be overreacting to the vibration from the pot bumpers. Uh, we'll check it out. I'll fire it. I'll, I'll fire him. I don't know. Because I, I keep hitting it, but I don't think it's automatically triggering. Oh my god. The other thing you can do with those is you can face them in two different directions. Like, you can put it in right. So if it is doing that, what I'll do is I will move. I will 180. I don't think it is, but I can 180 the switch so that the registering point for it is up higher and away from the pop bumper. But um, you wouldn't mind my play. Yes, it's quite interesting. I've been hitting that shot a lot tonight, though, I think. the multiplier because these would be pretty decent no and I hit it I lose both both the other pinballs at the same time that was a dumb rookie mistake I don't have any tilts left Dang. Um, let's see I don't think it is you're getting the multipliers fairly also it's not the loop switch that lights the multipliers um, Every Bond girl has a shot associated with it on the play field. a certain number of spinner rips lights the blue multiplier three shots Left scoop lights uh, P Glore. Um, what's her first name again? <laughs> Shots to the drops will light the, gre uh, the green Bond girl and so on. All right, let's see. I don't know. I feel like I've gotten in a little bit of a rhythm with those two shots. And this one, too. All right. Much better at hitting those shots on the on the fly. Like when the ball stopped, like barely moving. Not so good. Dude. Mm. Boom boys, he's probably just like, no, you did it again. I, I thought I might be able to sneak that in there before I got awarded the uh, 
thing for finishing, but maybe we'll get a crazy bath or something. Now I can't hit it now that I need it. Go. Thank you. Come on, give me, give me, give me, give me, give me. Oh, ha, ha, ha. Come on, dude. Come on. It helps in, uh, immensely to know what shot is associated with each bunker. That way you know where you need to go for the next multiplier. I'm going to read up on the instruction now. Swim with sharks and bath sub are pretty good with high multipliers. Um, there we go. Multipliers run. I Come on. Oh! I almost spaced out there for a second. That would have been bad. Go! All right, hunted by helicopter mo Oh, so we're in it. Um, the pops move your shots in this mode. Oh, okay. Um, oh, kind of like you're being hunted and shot and it moves around. That's kind of cool. There we go. Whoa! Screw it. It's going all in. This is ball three. I gotta read that. Hang on. Dude, I swear there's a ball somewhere. Is it in the scoop? Oh, was it trapped back there? I didn't, shit, I didn't see that. Um, yeah, that switch is triggered when the right pop upper comes down and gets close enough to trigger the inner loop magnetic reed switch with lights the playfield multiplier and extra ball. I'll check that out when uh, stream's over. So if that if that's actually what's going on, then we got to wipe scores. We're just going to wipe scores. We'll do it again. Oh shit. extra ball and lose it right away um if that's the case if that is actually what's going on and what i might do just to uh to make sure that isn't an issue is i'll 180 that switch so i'll take the screw out and you can turn it around that way the magnet part but it's it's not that close it's probably at least an inch away but again maybe it's because the magnet on the bottom of the play field is close to it so if i move it up maybe that'll that'll change it
Ah, oh, it's no fun. Oh, let's see. All right, 1.1 billion. All right, let's check this out since we're on stream because I want to know and you guys might want to know too. The proximity switch would only collect multipliers and help you get to extra balls more quickly. It isn't going to light multipliers when they're not qualified. Uh, yeah, let me let me just check it and see if it's doing that anyways. We're going to solve this right now because it's bugging me. I want to know. All right. We're going to switch menu in a second. All right. I don't think I've ever ended a stream on a maintenance note, but let's try it. Let's see what happens. Let me pull the pin out. All right, let's see. There you go. You're right. You look at the screen, it says side loop. It's the magnet under the play field, not the, uh, I was thinking it was the ring on the pop bumper. All right, well, there you go. It's all unofficial. <laughs> all right, well, I am going to uh, end the stream and I'm gonna flip that back around here, but we'll get back on bond again. Um, I'll look and see what the old GC was, but um, yeah, if that's triggering that loop and it helps get to extra balls, that's, we gotta fix that. Yeah, uh, pinball maintenance stream. <laughs> So that will get you the extra balls that collect flashing multipliers. Okay, there you go. So I'm not gonna count any of those scores I got tonight, but damn, it was fun. And now you can see if you're actually good at this game and you're hitting those shots, that there's a shitload of stuff to do. So let's see, on Saturday night at Zimmerman and Bar and Grill, I got a high score on Rolling Stones pinball uh, that they have of 35 million. I've gotten to record multi-ball during that game, nice. Um, uh, yeah, I was hitting the loop as well. So it's kind of a two prong because you can see it jump. Yeah. All right. Well, I'm going to flip that switch around, but thanks for hanging out with me tonight. Uh, regardless of the scores and we, I will, I will go probably go through and wipe those, uh, just the high scores in the top, like four or whatever, and leave the rest of maybe, I don't know, maybe I'll wipe them. It's probably a good time anyways, you know, cause you change something in the game. Why not? Um, all right, uh, just hold off on the multipliers and your scores. Yeah, yeah. Thanks for the uh, thanks for the stream. Uh, yeah, no problem. Anytime, man. I, I love doing this. It's always fun. So um, I don't know. Tomorrow night, I think I got something going on, but possibly Wednesday night uh, we'll get another game going. Oh, I'm so close to beating Venom. It's driving me nuts, but it's also making me angry. I've I, I've put probably 80 games on that thing in the last in like a two day span. It's it's killing me. It's wearing me out, but. Uh, we'll get, we need to get back on main soon. I want to get back on Stranger Things again. Um, so, uh, with that, I'm going to check and see who's streaming and we'll find somebody's channel to raid. Let me, uh, get this out of here. Get it back on a more visually pleasing screen. There you go. Um, all right, let's check and see who's on. Um, let's see. What was that? Uh, sorry. Oh, nice, sir. Great stream tonight. I'm participating in my first tournament tomorrow. Wish me luck. Yeah, dude, I wish you luck, man. It's, it's fun. Just remember, if it's your first tournament, like I like to chase after modes. So if you're somebody who likes playing the modes, um, remind yourself like, hey, this is about going after the things that score the most points the quickest. And I always have a problem kicking into that gear because I'm always wanna, I always wanna play modes. I'm, I usually don't care about scores too much, um, but the modes, I wanna get through the modes and I wanna beat the game. So, um, but yeah, when you're playing tomorrow, just keep that in mind and don't get mad. Just have fun, man. Uh, I played in a, a bunch of, like local ones and whenever I get too serious, it kind of ruins things for me. So just have fun. Usually when you have fun, you play better. So, um, yeah, good luck tomorrow night, sir. Uh, or tonight or tomorrow. Yeah, tomorrow. Sorry. Um, all right. I'm going to check see who's on. We'll find someone to raid. All right. Let's see who's playing what. They've been on for a long time, so uh, let's see. All right, let's raid flipping out pinball. Looks like they're playing a little Stranger Things game. Um, so 
it's a good game. I really like it a lot. You don't see people don't stream it that often, but I really like it. So, and I'm gonna stream it again soon. So uh, we're gonna raid flipping out pinball and watch a little uh, Stranger Things. But thanks for hanging out tonight, Bondo. Thanks for the bits. Uh, hopefully we can. Uh, uh, I'll fix that switch. Make sure that it's not gonna get triggered by the magnet um, under the play field. Um, but then we'll get back and we'll get another stream on this and get it done proper. So. Uh, thanks for hanging out tonight. I appreciate it. Uh, everybody stay safe. I will see you soon. And uh, stay safe and play more pinball. Thank you.